Hello and welcome again. Now in this EFT session, I am going to try to tell you how EFT, Emotional Freedom Technique, can be used to help evolve phobias. As I said before, as I've mentioned to you, I can't fix things. I can't take physical pain away. I can't cure illnesses. All I can do is try and help you to feel a little bit more at ease with situations which are depleting you of energy and to evolve your energies to feel better. Our motto in EFT is we can't solve it, we can only evolve it. So when it comes to phobias, um, I hate worms. I'm afraid of worms. I really, I really just, oh. <laughs> the first time I remember encountering a worm, a problem with this phobia with worms was when I was very small and we were out in the garden and sorry, I'm looking down because I'm imagining this worm and it was rolling across the pass and one of my little friends came up and sliced it in half. And to my horror, both halves wriggled off in opposite directions. And I feel, just now when I'm telling you about it, I feel shuddery, shivery, slightly nauseous, remembering this creature going off in two opposite directions. It's just disgusting. Okay. And now I, I will physically step back and... Um, when I encounter worms in the garden is, is something I've had to try and overcome because working with children, as you might expect, oh, they like nothing better than to wiggle a worm and dangle it in front of you and chase each other with worms. Um, so I've had to try and overcome that fear and disgust. But for this session, I'm going to try and encounter and relive the fear and disgust. Okay, so... It's, it's just, I, I can't stand it. I can't stand to see it going off in these two directions. And it's making me feel cold and clammy. Um, so it's here, it's in front of me. It's about a foot away in front of me. And I'm envisaging it as um, two big, ugly brown halves. So I'm going to tap on two big ugly brown halves and see if I can help these two halves to, to dissipate within my energy system. Okay, so here goes. Two big ugly brown halves. Two big ugly brown halves. Two big ugly brown halves. Two big, ugly, brown halves oh, wiggling off, <sighs> wiggling off. I can see them wiggling off opposite directions, drying out in the sun, <sighs> clammy. Cold, wet earth when you find worms just pop to the top. Two big, ugly, brown halves. Two big, <sighs> ugly, brown halves. But that was then. That was then. I'm not that wee girl anymore. I'm too. I'm not that wee girl anymore. And I know what worms are. Oh. 
And I know they can't hurt me. But if you put one in my hand, I wouldn't like it. I wouldn't like it. No, I still don't like worms. I'm not comfortable. I'm not comfortable being around them. And I don't like digging in the garden. I don't like worms. I don't like worms. Okay, so now, thinking about worms, thinking about that particular worm, I would say it's here, it's moved further out, it's about 18 inches out. Um, it's not feeling as if it's in two halves now, and it's not brown. I would say it's one whole worm. I can't get a colour on it. So what I'm going to do is tap on worms and just see how that evolves. And you'll have noticed in the last round, um, as it was happening, that the words, the feelings change. And that is to do with how the feelings evolve within my energy system, within me. My energy system is recognising that that incident was a long time ago. It's still has an influence on me because I don't like worms. But I'm not that young girl who was three or four years old who's going to go running off, terrified um, of what happened. So I'm going to breathe on worms and tap on worms and see how that evolves. Worms. <laughs> Worms. Worms. I hate worms. I really don't like worms. And I know that that's silly. My logical brain tells me worms won't hurt me. But I hate worms. Worms. I hate worms. Actually, I enjoy gardening. I enjoy plants. I like to see things grow. But I don't like finding worms. <sighs> don't like the feel of them. Don't like the way they crawl, wriggle, wriggle, appear in the mud, the soil that I'm meant to be enjoying. <laughs> Don't like worms. I know they're good for the soil. I know, I know worms have a good purpose. Pull out worms. Yes, I know I should go out and hold one, but I'm not going to put a worm in my hand today. No, I'm not holding a worm. I'm not, not enjoying worms. <sighs> worms. Worms. Worms, I'm so sorry, worms. Worms. Yeah. 
the worms are still there. Worms. 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 Okay, so I've got to the end of that session and I still don't like worms. <laughs> I've moved my worms, I've moved my worms out here to maybe maybe a bit two feet away from me now. Um <laughs> and uh, I'm sorry, but if I went outside and put a worm in my hand, I would probably still freak out a bit. So <laughs> I have encouraged my fear of worms to become less. I've dealt with it in my energy body, but no, I'm stuck with them for a while yet. So I'll have to keep working on that if, if I want to. You know, some some fears, some phobias, some things really aren't worth the stress we put ourselves through. And you just have to let them go. <laughs> I don't think worms will put me off enjoying my garden and enjoying flowers, um, but uh, I'll, I'll probably not become great friends with them in the next few years. <laughs> anyway, you can take this and have a laugh at it. And uh, if you've got something that uh, you're slightly afraid of, then you can try the EFT protocol on your fear and if you'd like to team up and we can work together on our fears then please do pm me okay <laughs> have a great day namaste